Hey you guys, my name is James Diaz and today I'm going to teach you how to play Paper Houses by Niall Horn on the guitar. This is going to be a really easy tutorial, I'm just going to teach the basic uh, chords and the strumming patterns for you. Right, so let's get started. The chords for the intro is going to be a C sharp minor, to a B, and then to an E. You're going to do that three times. C sharp minor, B, E, C sharp minor, B, E, C sharp minor, B, E, then you're going to play an A. And the chords for the first verse and the second verse, the In this house of broken hearts, it's the exact same chords as the intro. The C sharp minor, the B, and the E three times, and then you play an A. And you repeat that. C sharp minor, B, E, three times, and then you play the A. Um, and the chords for the chorus is going to be a C sharp minor to a B, to an E, to a B, then you're going to do that again, C sharp minor, to a B, to an E, to a B, then you're going to play a C sharp minor, to a B, to an A, to a B, to an A, to a B, and then you go back into the intro chord, C sharp minor, B, E, C sharp minor, B, E, then you would go into the second verse. Um, but it's the same as the first verse, so I'm going to skip ahead to the chords for the bridge. Alright, so then the chords for the bridge, you're coming out of the chorus, um, you're playing the intro chords, the C, B, E, C, B, E, I played those wrong, but C, B, E, and then you're going to go into the bridge, it's basically just the chorus again. It's uh, the C sharp minor, B, E, it's, uh, yeah, our paper, our paper houses reach the stars. Till we break and scatter worlds apart And then you're gonna go into this extra part The I don't wanna lose your touch I don't wanna hurt that much And it's gonna be a C sharp minor to a B To an E to a B To a C sharp minor to a B To a C sharp minor to an E So it's a C sharp minor To a B To an E To a B Then a C sharp minor To a B To a C sharp minor to an E then you go back into the chorus, um, and then for the very, very ending, it's, it repeats the Why do we climb uh, to fall so far? And it's going to be the A. Why do we climb to the B to fall so... And you end on an E. Far. Alright, so those are all the chords that you need to know for this song. So what I'll do is I'll play all the different parts of the song for you. The intro, the first verse, the chorus, the bridge and the outro, just so you can see where all these chords are basically placed in the song. And then I'll teach you a basic strumming pattern you could use at the end of the video. Alright, so the intro is going to go, uh... Then you do that again. Then you go to the A. Then you're going to go into the first verse. <laughs> in this house of broken hearts We made our love from a stack of cards Yes, we tried to hold on tight Cause we knew our love was hard to find Then you go into the chorus the stars till we break and scatter worlds apart yeah I paid the price on the skies why do we climb to fall so far And then you go into the second verse, but it's the same as the first verse, so I'm going to skip ahead to the bridge. And then the bridge, it starts out with the chorus, and it's kind of slower, and it goes, Yeah, our paper houses reach the stars Till we break and scatter worlds apart and Then you go into the I don't want to lose your touch I don't want to hurt that much I can feel it slipping away Yeah, I pay the price and you go back into the chorus, um, and for the very outro, it's Why do we climb? You're coming, and for the very outro, you're coming out of the chorus, you're coming out of the intro chords, and you 
go, why do we climb to fall so far? Oh, and that's basically where the chords are placed in the song, so I'll teach you a basic strumming pattern you could use now. Alright, so for the intro, a basic strumming pattern you could use is gonna be down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up, up. So down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up, up. For the chorus, a basic strumming pattern you could use is gonna be down, up, up, 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 down. That's a really basic strumming pattern you could use for this song. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that that helped you. I want to let you guys know about an awesome book called The Girl with the Train by Anthony Eden. These videos are sponsored by this book. It's really, really awesome. I read the whole thing myself. It's on Amazon. It's a really, really good book. It's a post-apocalyptic magnet punk. Like, it's like steampunk, but with magnets. And it's really, really awesome. You guys should check it out. Link in the description below. And uh, if you guys do get it and you like it, I want to ask if you guys could leave a review saying that James Hughes Music sent you, because that would be awesome. And I'll see you guys in another one.